Here we are. Quick connect for the putting green. Right there. Next to the T sign. Uh, difficult to find if you don't know where to look for it. Took me a very long time to find it the first time. Uh, but there it is, right next to the putting green. Just a quick word about the driving range. Uh, we have used the driving range for spare irrigation parts. Uh, one of the things we found out pretty early on is there's not enough money uh, to irrigate everything or enough water. Uh, both probably water is the more limiting factor. We just physically can't put out enough water uh, to keep everything irrigated. So in the past, uh, I'd say for the last four or five years, the driving range has not been irrigated and uh, we just continued that. But this year we did a little bit of rework so that the actual targets, uh, there are heads at the targets that can be turned on just to have little uh, green zones, but uh, the rest of the heads and the valves can be harvested to use on the rest of the course. Uh, they're their old Toro bucket heads, the big, uh, from the 80s or, or 90s, maybe even earlier than that, I think is when most of these were installed. And that's, that's one of them, but uh, that can be taken out and reconditioned and used for parts. And then the big two inch valves also can be used. So uh, that's our sprinkler stock.